KD, what's what's good? Like you, you have your you have your two dogs, which you you got you got Devin Booker, you got Bradley Bill. Mm. I mean, you don't have a bench, but I mean, you got Bobo and Grayson Allen, but <laughs> Bobo and Grayson Allen, oh man, and, and, and Nurkic, but like, what, what's good? Like, you want it, you wanted to be in Phoenix, you wanted to have a super team again. You got Bradley Steele. Bradley Steele. I mean, womp, womp. what's what's good? Like, you you just gonna go out like that first round? I hope not. Well, I'm looking at you. Hey, legacy. I know you got two rings, but I like both of these teams. So, like, I like the Timberwolves and I like the Suns. Well, I only like the Suns because of I, I like the Suns because of KD, you know. But I like the Timberwolves because I like uh, Anthony Edwards. I like Cat too. I ain't gonna lie. Like, even though I slander Cat a lot, I think he's soft. I do like. I love Cat's game, but he is soft. But. Are the Timberwolves outmatched by the Suns? No, like no. I don't think. Yeah, hold on, wait. wait. On. Regular season, I don't think. I don't think the Timberwolves beat them in the mm -hmm. regular season. So that's a, that's a, this is why this this series is interesting because they, they ain't beat them at all in the regular season. So I'm looking at it from that perspective. I'm like, is this a bad matchup for the Timberwolves? Who knows? I mean, it is Kevin Durant and Devin Booker getting his back. What the? Is my eyes deceiving me? The Suns are favorited on FanDuel to win the series? <laughs> oh, they are? <laughs> what the? Let me tell y'all, if y'all gamble, I want you to put your house and mortgage on that Timberwolves plus 114. <laughs> yeah, I guarantee but we got Jaden McDaniels. <laughs> I, will, I will say, that, like, that is I, I, look at, I look at the Timberwolves, they have a lot more pieces, obviously, like they have... Uh, <laughs> they have more people on that bench you can rely on. Anthony Edwards is a star, and Carl Anthony Towns is an all-star, all-NBA caliber player. Rudy Gobert, one of the better defenders in the league. Mike Conley is a quality point guard, even at this stage of his career. Jay McDaniels is a really, really good on-ball defender. So they have a lot of dudes. I mean, they got Alexander Walker. He's, he's a nice guy off the bench. So they, they, have, they have dudes. Oh. Nas Reed, like they got dudes, man. They 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 squad up, man. I thought Nas Reed was like a a, a eight year vet or something. Nas Reed is like two <laughs> he years just old came as, out, just came to the league. <laughs> he just looked old as a man. You know, they got drafted when he was like nineteen or twenty. Yeah. So he like he only like twenty six or twenty five now. Yeah, he, he pretty young. He pretty so young. I guess he is yeah, like a seven, 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 seven. He is pretty young. I thought like, like thirty or something. <laughs> he look, he look <laughs> old. Well, you guys look like you've been here for for a minute, man. <laughs> I think I, I'm gonna go. With, I'm gonna go with the Timberwolves, though. I just think that they Wolves have and six. Wolves and six. Oh, man. Wow. I, I just think mm -hmm. I look at the Suns and they've just been up and down. They've just been up and down this series. I understand it's Kevin Durant. I understand it's Devin Booker. But I don't think they have enough firepower. Like yeah, I get, yeah, the, yeah. I get the super team thing, but I don't really trust Bradley Beal that much. I feel oh, like Bradley Beal. Listen, Suns fans, if you ain't hit to play all <laughs> Beal. <laughs> Godspeed. That's all I'm gonna say. ISO playoff. Baby. Oh my goodness, man! I, I just think they have too many dudes. They could just yeah. The super team era. The super team era is done. Like I hate to say it, they might be. They not. They ain't. They. They. They not might. Uh, it's not. They might be too late. They are too late. Like the Suns didn't miss the super team era by like two, three years. All the good teams now, well, the recent team that's won championships that had two stars with good benches. And now these dudes got, got three three stars. Like, it's 2014, dude. Like, And then Bradley Bill not even a star. Bradley <laughs> Bill ain't a star no more, man. He never really was a star. He was an all-star. That's, 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 that's it. He was, he was an all-star. All he was he was always a, a second option. Yeah. And now he a third option. It's even worse. <laughs> Yeah, nah, Wolves and I'm gonna I'm gonna say Wolves and seven. I'm gonna say Wolves and seven. I ain't gonna say no, six. I'm gonna say seven. Yeah, I'm gonna change it to seven because the Timberwolves down the stretch do be pulling some crackhead maneuvers, and I'll be watching the game like, what is going on? So yeah, I'm gonna expect them to like had a game wrapped up, but then blow it towards the end when they should have won. So I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Wolves and seven. Yeah, I'm gonna go Wolves and seven as well. I think they went at home. I think uh, another thing, Frank Vogel. Mm. See, 
all these people talking about all these Lakers fans. Like, I miss Frank Vogel. He was the perfect coach for us. What is he doing with the Suns? They literally, what do they have, like, maybe two games? They're two games up on us. And they have KD, Booker, Beal. And they're only two games up on us. Is on a six. Kevin Durant, Bradley, Bill, Devin Booker on the sixth seed right now. Like, Come on now. Like, what are we doing here? People will be like, oh, Frank Vogel, he's such a superior coach. Darvin Ham, don't get me wrong. Darvin Ham is a bottom five head coach. But let's not act like Frank Vogel is freaking um, Eric Spolstra. Come on now. Like, Frank Vogel is regular. Like, he's mid. Like, that's what he is. Like, I don't know why people expect Frank Vogel to be this sort of savior. Like he's um like he's Mike Malone. Like he's not that's just not he's who just he a is. Full razor. That's it. He, he doesn't he his Frank Rose teams, they never reach their ceiling. They never do. He got very fortunate. He had LeBron and, and Anthony Davis. He got very fortunate. And then Russell Westbrook had to screw everything up. Like Russell Westbrook is the epitome of a franchise killer when you have him on your squad and you ask, Oh, he's he's the third option. Like No. <laughs> no, and he ruined Fred. Hey, regardless I'm not. I'm not confident in them. They're. I think they're done, and that's that. Uh, yeah. So let's. We got two more games to go. Just let me be.